So I wanted to give you a look at Simply Knitting issue 200. It comes with this extra uh, leaflet uh, with three designs and some tutorials. So that's a beautiful farewell sweater uh, or dress rather by Pat Strong. And then, hang on, see if I can. And then it comes with a tutorial on catching your floats so you avoid long floats. And then there's a shawl pattern by me. Um, which was originally published in the Knitter magazine a few years ago, two or three years ago maybe. Um, it's a crescent-shaped shawl. I pulled this out accidentally earlier. And then there's also an article by me, um, My Secrets of Shawl Design. So just a few things to think about if you'd like to design your own shawl. That's what that shawl looks like. That's it laid flat. And these are some of my other shawls that I've designed for. Um, I think these are all from the Knitter magazine actually. Um, and that is the swatch I knitted for the show. I'm just covering up the chart. And there's a pair of socks as well. Uh, they are by they are by um, Rian Drinkwater. A lovely pair of socks. I'm just going to try not to show you all the charts. Um, and also a tutorial uh, by Rian on no by Faye. Uh, this tutorial is by Faye. Uh, on how to do Judy's magic cast on, which is a very popular cast on for toe up socks. So that comes with the magazine. So sim simply knitting issue 200. Um, I've got a pattern in this issue, so let's just take a quick look and see what's in this issue. So that's all the things that are in the issue. So, really, summary designs, pretty cushion. I tried to design a cushion once and it wasn't very successful. Very pretty pattern, stripy pattern. Oh, that's cute. A little um, girl's cardigan with two flamingos on it. That's very, very cute. Um, these reader's letters. I'm struggling a bit for the focus because I haven't got my selfie stick. So I'm just holding the camera. So I do apologise for that. Um, so that's a cute um, sweater. I think that might be in the next issue. Oh no, that's in this issue. Um, so that's very nice. Uh, some some things from their contributors. I think the knitter, because it's the two hundredth issue, they're obviously having like a bit of a celebration. So, uh, party cake. That's cool. I like that. It's not really my thing, knitting stuff like that. I'm not very good at it. Then there's the knitting know-how pages. Um, boy sweater could be a unisex sweater really. Some little hair decorations. Then knitted, not crocheted, um, little soft toy, and that is um, a blanket square knit along. Ooh, men's sweater. It's nice to see men's garments in magazines as well, because a lot of them are obviously very focused on women. Some rainbows, which are all over UK windows at the moment. Um, cushion. I do have a pattern in here as well. Oh, there we go. There it is. So that's my pattern in this issue. It is knitted in UK alpaca, Surrey alpaca, four ply. And it took two skeins. And it is a 75% Surrey alpaca, 20% Hayakaya alpaca. Probably didn't pronounce that correctly. And 5% silk. And it takes two skeins. And each skein is 225 meters long. Um, it's a really nice yarn. Really soft, silky. It's called Summer Sun. Really pretty shawl. There you go. It's very simple. It's got it's knitted from the bottom up um, in a triangle shape. And it's got lace around the edges. And then it's got garter stitch in the middle. So if you want something that's fairly easy to knit and fairly quick, it's a good shawl for you. Or if you're new to shawls, it's also a very good shawl for you. So this is in what's in the next issue. Oh, I like that lacy sweater. That's pretty. I really like that. Um, yeah, so that was just a very, very quick look at issue 200 of Simply Knitting magazine. And um, this extra, this comes with the magazine with this feral dress, my shawl and a pair of lacy socks. So uh, Simply Knitting is either in the shops in the UK now or will be in the shops in the UK in the next few days, I expect. If you're not in the UK, um, I suggest you Google Simple Knit Simply Knitting. I think you can probably get a by digital copy 
or order it online but just google simply knitting and you'll find it thank you very much for watching